the world and just education in general is getting more secular and away from religion and away from faith and you know you can't say god and the pledge of allegiance anymore and and just saying that that's concerning so to switch that up and to completely bring god nature all of his works and and his teaching scriptures into day-to-day -day learning i mean that that just is going to change things your kids it builds their confidence and you can see God in every single subject. And so to just bring that in, it's it's a huge blessing. I, yeah, I feel like my kids, um, their confidence has increased and they're just happier. I have six children and they all started out in public school. Um, I always wanted to try it, but I was scared. I didn't know what it was like. I didn't know if I could teach multiple kids on multiple levels. And so I kind of just, Put them into school thinking it, they're fine they're gonna be just fine and um anyway through a few other outside circumstances covid being one of them and then my husband's work we decided to homeschool so we're in our just third year of homeschooling and um it's interesting you know i thought oftentimes it would be a lot easier to just send my kids to school it's in our backyard the playground is in our backyard and it would be quite easy just to say have a good day see you in seven hours when you're done with school um so it's definitely been a change and a big sacrifice but um i feel like my kids are worth it they deserve it and we've loved it i used to be that mom who was yelling at my kids in the morning you're gonna miss the bus get out the door you know here's your lunch and we're we don't end up reading the scriptures and we don't have family prayer because we're just in a rush, right? We're just trying to get all these kids out the door on time. And I hated that. I, I'd close the door and think, oh, what have I left my kids with? A yelling mom who's like mad at them for being late? That's horrible. And so um, just that alone, just the mornings where we can have breakfast together and we can, you know, have prayer and scripture study together and we can get our day started just a lot gentler. Um, just that alone has been a huge blessing for our family. One thing about regular school is I wouldn't know who my kids' friends were. They would just tell me about them. I'd know their names, but I hadn't met them. And, and then I wouldn't know their kids' parents. But in this setup, you know who your kids' friends are. You know who your kids' friends' parents are because they're your friends too. And so you have this just this tight-knit group where the older kids love the little kids. The parents know your children. You know, it, you just have this really tight community it has saved me with homeschooling. It is the reason my kids are like, we don't want to go back to school. What we have, these are our best friends. And us parents are really good friends. And so, yeah, we're not alone. And we don't feel alone in this because we have this support group. And it's not being forced on you. That's what, you know, when you go to school, sit down, listen, I'm going to teach you. Whereas we, my kids, about fifth grade and up are mostly self-learners. They almost do all of their work on their own. And so it's more like, yeah, they know what they have to get done, but they're motivated to get it done. They're motivated to, to go through the lessons and to learn and to, you know, so I just love that. It just switches the approach completely. Instead of sit down, shut up and listen, it's you're in charge of your learning. Do it. <laughs>